This is going to be a rust removal video I've been asked to do. I always explain how to do it whenever you purchase one of my knives, but I've never shown how to do it. I'm going to be doing this on a mirror polished blade that I made. One of the first knives that I made, actually. Uh, it's not super bad. It does have some pitting on it, but we're going to get it all off for the most part. Uh, the first and foremost thing you want to do is you want to dull this knife completely because uh, you will more than likely cut or poke yourself at some time doing this and i would rather it be a small cut than a bad cut especially if it's one of my knives it's going to be very sharp you're going to have to secure it somehow anyway i'm using a knife vise that i made uh, you're gonna need three in one oil or any kind of oil and then very fine steel wool. If it's real bad rusted, you will have to go back and use sandpaper and work your way up through the grid. You wanna go long ways down the blade from point to handle. This will take some elbow grease, will take some time. It took me about 45 minutes on one side. Uh, basically keep going until you can't feel it anymore. Now I'm going to use a buffer. Uh, I'm using green compound and a denim fabric wheel. A sisal wheel would have been better to start with, but mine exploded the other day, so this is what I got. Uh, you wanna go long ways down the blade again. Stay on the bottom of the buffing wheel if you've never used a buffer before, because it will grab a hold of it. I don't care how stout you are. It will take it away from you and give it back when you don't want it. Take your time, don't overheat the blade because it's easy to do. Once you do that, there is no going back. It took me about another 45 minutes and I pretty much got every bit of it out except around the Ricasso. The only way I could have got there is if I'd have took the handles off and that would have broke the handles and I'd had to rehandle it and it was, wouldn't have been worth it. You can still see them a little bit, but they are gone for the most part. If you don't have a buffer, you can do this with a terry cloth and buffing compound. You don't have to have a buffer. There you go. Everything but the Ricasso where I couldn't get. Thanks for watching. Think of me next time you need a knife.